Wesley Snipes went on to make a name for himself in Hollywood with movies like White Men Can't Jump and New Jack City. He also brought the half-vampire Marvel superhero Blade to life and that hit movie series. So Wesley Snipes has more than 70 films on his resume, including 18 as a producer. And now he's released his debut novel, a spiritual thriller called Talon of God. A spirit warrior named Talon must convince a doctor to help him stop a powerful demon from creating hell on earth. Wesley Snipes joins us at the table in the studio. Good Very, morning, good morning. Very good to have good you morning. here, Wesley Snipes. Good to be here. Good we still be. remember the movie White Man Can't Jump. This is a white man, he can jump. Oh, is yeah? <laughs> he got skills. Just, okay. just saying in case you we want to challenge We have to get you on the court back the out court. there yes. in Venice. Well, you can do be, that. You'd be in trouble. <laughs> but listen, I know that you've written before. I know you've written movie scripts. I know you've you written in college. Yeah. But this is your first debut novel. And when, when I walked in the green room, he said, I am an author. Yes, <laughs> Take us yes. through that process, Wesley yes. Snipes. How you go from that to writing a supernatural thriller, really. What a journey, what a journey. Very different from writing scripts, writing books. How I got so? a whole lot of respect for writers. It's a little bit more disciplined. Uh, it's a little more isolated. And you don't get the same kind of uh, flexibility with uh, writing characters and writing scene shots and all of these things in the, uh, in the script like you do with uh, the book. But how did you know you could do this? How did you know? Well, I didn't. Uh -huh. I didn't. Uh -huh. You know, I said the challenge is to be a uh, scholar, a healer, mm -hmm. and a soldier or a martial artist. Mm -hmm. So you try to combine the combination of those qualities uh, and see where you find yourself in them, test yourself and push yourself. So for me, this was another opportunity to express the divine within me mm -hmm. through my art. All right. And are you still acting? Am I still acting? Mm -hmm. Why, of course I'm still acting. <laughs> <laughs> but of course. <laughs> because there's talk about a remake of Blade. Uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. There's been some discussion about that. You know, uh, you know they I'm have a fantastic. I'm going to take that as you're interested, don't, aren't you, Nora? We'll no, see. no, no. It's been it's been well known that I'm interested. I okay. think that we left. We, we didn't accomplish exactly what we could have accomplished, mm -hmm. and there's a lot of room to continue to tell that story, but we had a new story here, you know, no, telling no, God this, is the... No, it, it really, it's, 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 he, he likes the odd and inexplicable. Yeah. I mean, it's supernatural stuff. The topic is very interesting to me that you would choose that. Uh, the book, yeah. What, are the yeah. Thing, what thing are you most proud of, and what do you regret most about this really long career and all the films that we talked about? One thing that I'm most proud of, oh, that the ancestors and the good Lord have blessed me to have this opportunity to take this journey, that I've grown from it, that I've become more clear on what my potential is and the relationship with the divine and how to use those uh, spiritual insights in my art, in my craft, in my day-to-day -day life. And regret? Regrets? Regrets, regrets. Yes. Ah, that I didn't get the role, you know, didn't get the chance to dance behind uh, La Queen Latifah as a backup dancer. That's about. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> well, you've lived well, a good life. Well, I started out as a dancer. That's it, yeah, you've lived yeah, a good I life. I started out as a dance, dancer and a, and a musical theater artist. Yeah. So, so, how do you go to this to the supernatural? Because I'm really fascinated by what you and Ray Norman have done in this book. There are demons, <laughs> demons you know, there, everywhere. There are demons, and it's yes. supernatural and it's scary. Yes. Well, I, I, I grappled with the question of. Why do we do the things that we do? Uh -huh. What makes us do the things that we do? Right. And why do we do things that we really don't want to do, yeah. didn't want to do, and we end up doing them? Maybe there are forces that are playing on us. Maybe there are forces that are influencing us and our behavior. Soul demons, soul vampires that get us into trouble. The lead character is a woman who's a female protagonist. I like her. Yes. Yeah. The yes. Dr. Jefferson, yes. she's a bad Girl power. Yeah. Oh. I watched Beyonce's uh, video, Who Run the World, and yes. I said, okay, well, that's clear to me. He's got to yes. be a girl. And <laughs> Superwoman <laughs> did reasonably well. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Wonder, yes. Yeah, Wonder yeah. Woman. Wonder Woman. Great, yeah. too. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Yes, yes. Wesley Snipes, good to have you here. Congratulations to you and Ray Thank you. On, on the book. Thank you. Come to the book uh, signing later on today at, the, uh, at uh, Barnes & Nobles in Tribeca. Mm -hmm. And, That's called uh, a plug. Is, it, is that what it's yes, called? Yes, it's called a plug. And oh, the movie's yeah. coming out soon, I know. Yes. <laughs> and Talent of God yeah. is on sale today. Oh, man, we're doing a lot of stuff right now. <laughs> and <Exciting>. this story. <laughs>